All right, <clears throat> welcome back to some TFT with me, McCrathy. This works really well because we're actually going Dragon Lord because we're still doing uh, the uh, what do we want here? This is yes, we put this in as well. Uh, yeah, we're doing a Diana um, game. I guess it is. I don't know what to call it. A Diana Diana Flex games. Uh, where we're basically just flexing to flexing the Diana up as high as we can. I think Titan's Resolve is pretty good. I'm gonna have to slam that on her because I think it's I think it's worth it. Uh, these are obviously not used. So what are we doing? We're doing Diana. We're doing a Diana flex game. Obviously, we have a Dragon Lord emblem, so we'll be going Dragon Lords. Uh, we need the Janna. We need the Lee Sin, and we need the Rakan. And we have an emblem, so that'll be one extra thing we get. Uh, we also want to go Zyra. Uh, we want um, Morgana. And we want Wukong. This will give us four of these. Uh, and then we basically want to figure out what else we can get here. Probably want to get um, Annie. Yeah, Annie's the last one there. This is our eight. So we're going to start from this, and we're going to see where we end up basically how far we can go i don't think we can use these i kept them because i mean fortune things you know who knows could be could be great but uh i don't know if we're actually going to keep this or not um i would like to replace this with something else obviously but for now this is what we got um so we're going to keep that it would be nice to get an annie go right here and you could become the dragon lord but i don't actually think i want to put the dragon lord emblem on any i think i want to put that on a unit that i'm not using any other items on because the dragon lord bonus doesn't apply any differently to anyone holding or having the dragon lord emblem so it's not really required on them uh does she survive if she shields oh she did i think she still dies though this guy's got ethereal blades that's gonna be hard to deal with but it's fine <clears throat> it's okay. Exalted this time is Jax, Tom Kent, Thresh, Tristana, Kane. So absolutely nobody that we're looking for. So, yeah, I don't need to worry about that. I'm actually going to sell all this crap, too. We don't want any of those. Um, we could get another bruiser, I guess. Would be okay to put in here. But, yeah, we're not really looking for much. We do have a lesser champion duplicator. We will use that on the... Um, probably on the Diana... We might use it on the Janet if we get Janet, or Zyra if we get Zyra. Um, they're all very good units. So we'll just use it on the last one that we're going to get. Or if we don't have Diana and it doesn't look good for these guys, we'll just put it on the Diana. Or if we're getting, like, contested. Which I don't know if we are or not. No Dianas. No Dianas here. No Dianas here. No Dianas here. No Dianas here. So, you know, it's pretty early to get Dianas. We got it with our Augment, so it's not, it's not normal to have that by now. But it's good to good to just check if someone had three Dianas now that we know they're going to try and make Diana work because why wouldn't you make Diana work, right? Okay, come on, Diana. Use your ability. Use your ability. Oh, you got a shield. That, that's amazing. Good job. You die, but we still win. Excellent. That's what we like. Okay. What do we want here? We get another champion duplicator, which is great. The Shen is probably good to take because that dude's going that Shen build. So it's nice to have that. Plus, it's coming right towards me, and it has uh, an item that we want on it as well, so that's really good. Let's see. Definitely don't need this, but we do like having this. This is basically Diana thrives with one tank item, like one pure tank item, two pure damage items, or some sort of mix of, you know, one third tank, two thirds damage. He are, she already has, this is maybe a quarter of a, you know, or maybe a half of a tank item. It's not all tank, but it's not all damage. So we probably need another half and half like a crown guard and then we can go a full damage item as well 
Or we could go full tank if our if our front line, if we don't have an Annie yet, we don't have a Wukong, we don't have a Rakan, and we're just struggling, we can just put another tank item on her. That's part of the flex of this team, right? You can you can really flex to whatever you really need to do based on the situation that you're in. You don't have to you don't have to conform to one uh, or another um, way to play it, which is why it's called a flex and why it's so good. Uh, it just is really good. Diana, obviously a really good unit. Um, she's a little bit underappreciated early. I think people are starting to catch on, and so she's getting a little bit more popular, which is why we're seeing a lot more people play her. But again, it's, yeah, it's okay. All right. <clears throat> we could put this in. It doesn't really help us that much, though. I think we just sell it for the gold. It's fine. Um, do I want to change my bruiser? Is this a better bruiser? N61? No, 700. Ribbon is still a better bruiser. That's fine. Uh, but on this though, no, not a two star. We'll keep the two star for now. Plus she heals and stuns. She has some CC, so she's really good. And... Dragon Lord comes out strong. Malphite. Thing is, Diana can basically heal through their entire damage. So I think she won B3s, but maybe not a two star Malphite. If that was a one star Malphite, I'd say for sure. But not two star Malphite, unfortunately. Yeah, she doesn't get enough time to cast. It's okay, we're at 50 gold now, and uh, we are ready. Oh, Tristana, no, I don't think I want you. I think we take the Invoker, honestly. Uh, we have an Invoker here. She's, you know, an obviously very good unit just in terms of damage. So we, sh we definitely take her. We have the Lee Sin shortly, hopefully. Dragonlord's very good. Five Dragonlord is exceptionally good. We get 45% attack speed, which is uh, pretty wild. And that's on everybody. Plus you do damage. Okay, took a little longer than I would have liked. We don't get our 50 gold out of it, but that's fine. Uh, now, I mean, I guess we go Archangels, right? We need this. We don't want to use this. We'll probably turn these into um, Spear of Shojins. And we'll put the Alun in. Alun, like I said, just a really good unit. Let's take a Lowy. We don't have... Arcanist. We'd like to get Zyra, but uh, we don't have that yet, so we'll just hold on to the Alawi for now, since we have the 50 gold. We don't need anything else. by Faded. Nothing new there. I think that was 5 Faded too, right? That's pretty rough. Stationary Support, Capricious Forge. Oh, this is really good. Especially on Annie, you can get some really good items there. Slam and Ascension Martyr. I think it's this. Uh, I think that's the best. Uh, I don't know who to put it on. I think we probably want to put it on... Let me take this off. Put this on the Ribbon. Put this on the Alawi. I mean, rapid fire, death fire, that's <laughs> not ideal items, but that's fine. That's okay, it's not ideal items. Um, going porcelain would be nice too, the sniper, but we're not doing that, so that's fine. Still three dragon lord. We're just rolling now, or just uh, leveling up now, that's all we want to do.
Okay, come on, Diana. She's got super HP now, or super AP, so she should heal quite a bit. She does a lot of damage. Uh, oh, we have another Alawi with a blacksmith. That's really funny. Oh, dude, did you see that? She full healed that. That was amazing. Horizon Focus, Eternal Winter. That is pretty good, but come on, heal. Oh, dude, that heal was amazing. Well done, Diana. One star versus one star. Take it. Take it. Yes. Good job, guys. Good job. Okay, level six. We put... I don't know what in. Something in. Uh, I guess we put in... A bruiser? I guess we can do this. Yeah. Okay. Um, not, I mean, okay items on her, I guess. Hole Crusher, I, I didn't notice that. I wasn't paying attention, though. Uh, Alawi has, wait, what? Oh, I see. She got the Suspicious Trench Coat, and it actually gave different items. That's wild. That's actually pretty crazy. So this gave her different items. That's really funny. That's why I didn't see this. I thought, I was like, wait a minute, I would have seen that. That's why I didn't see it, because it was not actually there. I'm going to take this for no reason. Diana's, Diana's, no Diana's. But we do want a tank item on her now, or at least a half tank. Um, it'd be great if we could get this. We can get a crown guard, but I'd maybe stuck with this. Yeah, I'm going to get stuck with that. That's okay. This is good for me. No problem at all. <sighs> Nautilus is not really where it's at. Hmm. I guess we're just going. There's really nothing else for me to put in right now. So that's fine. damage going out here oh we got it I think we got it this ethereal blade Shen has no items dude oh he does so much damage though even with no items he slaps dude wow wow dude I can imagine him with the uh, talisman of ascension would be really bonkers double Tristana still don't want it you still can't Still can't give it to me. That's that's fine. Okay, I guess we'll grab this three cost just to roll it for now. I don't know if Hextech is really good on her. The Omnivamp is not that great because we're going to end up getting um, the Sage bonus which gives you Omnivamp. So I don't think that the, the Hextech is very good for her. I think she just wants pure damage. Right? I think that's better for her. Oh, we're starting to get outscaled by the by the bigger units, the more costly units. Oh, Sniper's focus on her. I guess that's pretty good. Pretty good. I remember when Kaisa came out and Sniper's Focus was on her, she would do like a billion damage because she could be in this corner and her ult would still hit this corner. And this, so the guy over here would take a very lot of damage. That was pretty fun. 
I saw a Kabuko game on, uh, I think he was on um, Reddit or the Reddit subreddit or maybe on YouTube or something like that. And the dude had a Kabuko that did um, basically 660,000 damage because he had two Talismans of Ascension and then the Ludens. And then he just like stuck him in the corner with like two Aphelios and then just waited for the whole round to be over. And then the Kabuko would get like 16,000 HP, but his damage, I mean, he would do like a million damage, right? And it was, yeah, it was really crazy. That was really wild. Okay, we have a Exalted Cane. How many, oh, we have two Exalteds in here. I think we just put this in there. Forget the bruisers. Forget these, we don't need these, we don't need this. Let's go find some. Oh, actually. Thresh is a good idea too. Let's put a Thresh in here. Actually, let's put this in here for the invokers. Dude. Dude, see? Look, we get so many. Uh, did we take. No, we didn't take her out, right? No, she's right there. So that'll two star her. Do we keep the cane? I guess so, right? Do we keep the invokers? I guess so, right? I think Sage is the best part of this this thing though, so I don't know why we're we want invokers, but I mean I guess that's I guess that's fine. I could give him a rage blade, right? Could give him a rage blade and a hex no rage blade and a death blade, I guess. Could be something that we do. Uh, we want yeah, these are all silly. We, we want what we want. Okay, Needlessly Large Rod is really good. Tons of stats. Invoker Crest, another crest that we can use. Holy crap. I think we gotta take this, right? The Invoker doesn't give... Oh, invokers get extra bonus, actually. So, the Invoker... goes on... Thresh. This guy gets a Rage Blade. This guy gets a Death Blade. And we still want to oh, two star both of those. Wild. Invokers. Uh, who do we take out? We take this out, right? Put this in. And Invoker on who? I guess we'd do it on Kane? No, Invoker on him. <laughs> Why not? Oh, who did I? Oh, Th Thresh was the Exalted. Oh, I didn't realize that. Well, I guess we're gonna have to put Tristana in then. Okay. I guess we'll put this on Azir. We don't really need to worry about too much about Diana now. Um, she's good. She's still a good unit. Uh, but now we have... We actually have six Invoker if we grab the Elune and the Annie. That's pretty wild. 35 mana to invokers and 20 to others dude we'll be casting so much i still want to get this exalted in though do we, do we level up for it i don't think so right i don't think so i think i'd still rather have the thresh though to be honest diamond hands okay wind streak let's just get the wind streak okay zyra this is our sage is this better than this this is probably better than this, right? A random bruiser. I think we give her Dragonlord and Sage. Then we got four Invoker, three Dragonlord, two Sage, two Ghostly. Sweet. We just need to replace this with Annie. This is Annie here. Yeah, I think this is fine. Oh my god, the Morgana now? Dude, this game is insane. We're getting so many good units, but like, I, I, it's so hard to put them all in. We need the Annie. Maybe we take the Zyra out and we put the Morgana in, right? That makes more sense, doesn't it? Put the Invoker on someone else, I guess. Oof. That's okay. We're still good here, I think. Yep, Azir damage wins out. Nice. Uh, are we ever using this? Are we putting Exalted back in? I don't think so, right? No, we're not. Okay, we sell this for the gold. Whew. 
Kurt keeping up with all these. Okay, what are we taking? He probably wants one of these, right? He needs a spear. Oh, we could get a Lilia too. What's better, two star Lilia? No, I think getting this is better. Two star Lilia is good, but we don't we don't really need that item too hard. So I think this is fine. Yeah, I think this is fine. I'll take this Zara off. Maybe with the Dragon Lord on Kane, we're not gonna. Well, I don't know. We might we might put some stuff on him. I actually don't know for certain. Put this in for certain though. Honestly, I don't know how good these invokers are. I think sages might be better. Right? This gives him Omnivamp too. Like, how much damage did Azir do? He did okay damage, you know? He did okay damage. But is it, you know, better than everybody's? I don't know. Man, we keep getting keep getting good units. <clears throat> okay. Are we going six invoker? I can't imagine we're going six invoker, right? I actually don't need this. That was silly. I don't need this. I don't need this. I, I think we take this out, actually. And I think we put the Zyra in. I think the AP is way better. Oh dude, why is this guy got an edge of night? Do you know how to play Shen? I mean, you got a three star, congratulations, but like, I don't, I don't know you know how to play Shen. Okay, there's our second invoker. So we'll have three invokers total, right, with Lilia. Oh no, we'll have four. Four invokers is good too, that's fine. Because this guy is now coming out. Oh my god, two wits ends. Wait, what? Okay, Annie. That goes there. All right, let's let's three star this guy. Let's put this here. We already have four invokers, so I don't need to put an invoker down. Oh, I don't want that actually. Oh my god, another Azir, dude. What? Wow, that's crazy. We keep these four. I guess we keep these four, hey, and then we just try to get as many sages and dragon lords as we can. Seems legit to me. Uh, this uh, Annie seems pretty crazy. She heals half the damage that she does. Do you guys know how much damage she does? She does a lot of damage, and so she's healing seventy-five or seventy percent of all that. That's pretty sick, dude. That's pretty sick. Um. Yeah. Okay. We keep rolling. We sin. Good. Kane. Good. Annie. Good. Diana. Good. I think we just keep adding these in. So this is the next one to go in. Dragon Lord, right? Four Dragon Lords. I think it's really good. And he got Spectral Cutlass, Silvermane. That's an interesting combination. Uh, do we do Bloodthirster or something? What do we do with this? Is Janna in? Oh man, two star Annie now? Yeah, Janna's in. We don't need that. We do want these. I do kind of like the Zyra, not gonna lie. Who do we need items on? Oh my god. Wow, did we really just get that? That's amazing. Okay, this is insane. Unending Despair and Innervating Locket. Oh, Unending actually doesn't... She doesn't do a shield, but she gives a shield. Um, Deathblade? Do we do Deathblade, I guess? A second Deathblade on him? I don't know if that was the right choice. Oh, we also have an item here. We could have put an item there. That's okay. Okay, the next sage is here. We we don't need to level up anymore. We can just uh, put our units in now. I think I think sage is still better than dragon lord though, right? Although for dragon lord we get the stun. I think we put four dragon lord in first, and then level nine we put the sage in. So we basically just need to level up now. We don't need to do anything else. This team is absolutely insane. 
if we get a reforger i'll definitely reforge these but like this is this cane is not really required anymore i actually wonder if we should just take it out i think we wait until we have three lee sins i mean he did like most of our damage there so it is pretty good and he does get a lot of mana in this because he gets yeah he gets a lot of mana invokers uh four invokers gives 20 to him let's put it on him see see how much he gets when he gets his when he gets his mana swamp it's nice He actually didn't do that much there, but Annie almost died, or Annie died. Diana, not so much. She should be fine. We still need another item for her, though. I f kind of forgot that when I put the Death Blade on him. I should have remembered that, but I didn't. So, one more item on her, one more item on him, him, I guess. He's a him, Azir, a, the bird, the bird man. Okay, Annie. Seekers is good. Wit's End is okay. Doable, I guess. Ah, this is the Dragonlord Invoker. This is really good. I really need the Sages in, though. We have five Invokers. Let's take this out. And let's put the Sage in. Just because we get the 20% Omni Vamp is pretty big for the team. We'll be level 8 next. We'll put this in. For the four dragon or oh no, we this is the third dragon lord too. Uh, too many units that we want to get in. I think this is why the uh, that plus one units badge that you get that's a that's really good. The tactician's crown, I guess it's called. It has been called the same thing since uh, set one. <laughs> I keep forgetting what it's called. The earth item. Oh my god. Oh my god, Shen. Can you stop, buddy? Just take that L. Take the L, buddy. Chill your life. Chill your butt. Uh, t we have two lesser champion duplicators, too. I don't know who to use that on now. I guess Zyra, or I guess Janna. We get one more Janna. We win. Oh, we're done. Second place, I guess. Right. Yeah. Okay. I forgot that this was... There was no portal in this game. Okay, well, I guess I was planning for something that never happened. But this is how you flex. We got like three canes or we got a cane and that's like amazing then we get two more so it's like might as well just keep that anyway um that's a pretty bad that's a bad augment or a bad encounter guys uh, just take that out please right no one wants to end the game at 5-4 i was just getting started but i think i would have won that all right guys thanks very much and we'll see you guys uh, in the next video